Evaluation Template. The evaluation template is the template that will be used for all your evaluation events. If you do not evaluate all players using the same metrics, you can simply create another group and have a different template for those players. To do this, select the drop down arrow by your group name, then select the plus arrow to add another group. If you're a paid account holder, you have the ability to do this. As a paid account holder, you will also have access to an unlimited number of groups and unlimited evaluators. Okay, let's get started with our template. Select Evaluation Settings from the left navbar. Then select Evaluation Template. You'll notice three categories to the left. Catcher, Fielding, Pitching. The plus arrow beside Categories allows you to easily add whatever categories you like. For example, you might have more than one positional category if you evaluate positions differently. The category Fielding Positions, for example, would be scored and evaluated differently than Pitchers and Catchers. We're going to start with the category Fielding. Let's select the character Metrics. Now, click on the metric you would like to edit or view. We can see this score is subjective between 0 and 10, and both the increment and the subjective rating can be changed. Select Preview to see what it will look like to evaluators. Now click Save. If for some reason you wanted to delete the metric, you would click on the three dots to the right of each metric. To add a new metric, simply select Add Metric. Another character metric might be something like Communication. Keep in mind, the metric you add should align with the skill grouping. For example, we might add something like 40 yard dashed speed. We're going to go ahead and add this new metric. Since we are scoring this only once, we will select Single Score. Go ahead and select Seconds for the unit. This will initiate the stopwatch. If you're scoring more than once, you simply select Type and change it to Multi-Score. You can go to the preview and see the change and select Save. Please note, your new custom template will appear in the Skillshark app as soon as you create your first event. If you change or delete metrics after an evaluation, you will delete any data connected to that metric. However, if you add skills and metrics to your template, they will show up in later reports as the scores are collected.